Hey, what's going on guys? Thrash back here. Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to Hut Warriors. Two more games here today. We're going to start off the episode, per usual, with one of our silver rerolls. But I will go ahead and give you a little update on the team. Give you a little bit of a rundown of what we're doing here. So, the team is Yanni Gora, Martin Nechas, and Mad Zuccarello. We've got Fabry, Horvat, and Zadina. Lee, Glendening, and Aquin. Carr, Pajo, and Patrick. On defense, we have Tim Heed and Zach Wierenski. Roman Yossi and P.K. Subban, and Justin Hall with Jake Muzzin. And in net, we're looking for a new goalie, but we've been using Peter Mrazek. We do need an upgrade on that goalie. Now, this is my Road to Div 1 series. We can only get players by opening packs. That is the only way is to get packs. We cannot buy players off the auction house, anything like that. So we open up packs for every win. When we get a win, it's a regular base win, we open up just the regular small base pack. That'd be this one right here. If we make them rage quit, we get a premium pack, and if we get eight or more goals in the game, we get to open up a special pack. That could be any one of these three. It's our choice, whatever we want. Now, if we get a hat trick, score four or more points, or get a shutout in a game by a single player, we get to open up one of the premium gold player packs with a guaranteed 80 overall. Now, we do have the regular silver reroll, which is this one right here, that we're going to open up to start off every episode. We get to add whatever we want from this pack to the team. And so far, we have, I mean, Johansson's not, not awful. We also get a Gabriel Landeskog. Interesting. 83 overall. We're definitely going to be adding Landeskog to the team. We can only add one player per pack. But we'll go ahead, add him to the team, and then we'll see how we, uh, we do with game number one. I went ahead and added Landeskog to the first line. Moved down Yanni Gordon, got rid of Daniel Carr. So, those are the changes. Let's get into game number one. All right, guys, here we go. We're currently 3-0 here in Division 9, trying to work our way up. He has Brock Besser. It's like uh, Miko Koivu. Could be the new one, the leader's one. So he definitely has a, a solid squad, it looks like. He's got Jones. and Oh, he's got Bork. He's got Bork. That could be uh, that could be interesting. So he's definitely got a good team. Let's see if we can uh, try and pick up a W here. Nice play. That's going to be Kevin Hayes. Damn, I thought I uh, I thought I played that pretty well, but the pass got through. Kevin Hayes buries it. He's uh, actually that's a pretty good team. He has a pretty good team. He's up one nothing. There you go, Nolan Patrick. Good little passing play, Nolan Patrick wide open, and we do get it to him. It's one one, but uh, I, I do want to say we have been all over this guy. I think he only has that one shot on goal, and it is a goal. But I think we've had the puck in his zone the entire time here. And that's Taylor Hall just tipping it home. Easy. Easy for him. All right. Well, 2-1 just like that. I'm pretty sure that's his second shot on goal. That's uh, that's rough. Go Zadina. Go Zadina. Try it on the backhand. It's in. Philip Zadina. Let's go. If only you were doing that in real life, buddy. 2-2 two -two game. See if we can uh, start getting uh, some more shots on goal here, because we we are obviously we're dominating this game, but it's two two. Maybe one last chance. Four seconds here. Go, Glenn Denning. Get in. He played the pass. There was nobody there, but Glenn Denning couldn't bury it, and that is gonna do it for your first period. Damn, there was no one there to pass to. He played the pass, but we could not find the back of the net. Kevin Hayes gets play of the period. I don't know. It wasn't that spectacular. I don't know, game. I kind of feel like Zadina's walk-in was kind of nice, but whatever. Whatever. It's fine, game. It's fine. You you celebrate what you want to celebrate. We need to start uh, playing some defense, because if you take a look, two goals on two shots, time and attack. We have five times the amount of time on attack, six times the amount of shots. Like, this is getting out of hand. We need to start, uh, well, what, we need Morazic to make a couple saves here. We need Morazic to make a save, but we need to start uh, burying some of these pucks as well. He's going all the way. Oh, he come on! Oh, our future captain right there, Tim. He not able to bury it. As soon as we pull a captaincy card, we will uh, we will give it to him. By the way, I know people have been asking. He better save this. Jesus Christ, Morazic! <sighs> One big chance leads to another. We're down three to two. Oh, there it is. Peter Mrazek, first save of the game. Only 32 minutes. 32 minutes, more than half the game it took for him to make a damn save. Oh, my God. 4-2. to two. 
Mirazic has made one out of five saves here. I mean, some of it might be poor defense, but this is getting out of hand. Come on, Patrick. There you go, Nolan Patrick. It's his second of the game. I'm also going to call a timeout here. Look at the stats. This is ridiculous. There's no reason for us to be losing this game. So I'm going to call a timeout. Maybe that'll re spark Mirazic here and we can uh, tie it up. Go, Zook. Go, Zook. On the backhand. And now they're saying no goal. They're going to say he kicked it in or is it goal interference? That better be a come on game. Do not screw with me here. I'm not. I'm not gonna skip it. I want to see the. I want to see the. That might be goalie interference. To be honest, it could be a kick. Could be goalie interference. I don't know what way they're gonna go with it. Come on, be a goal. Be a goal. You son of a. You gotta be joking. This game is just against us. All right, Nate, your turn. Please, for the love of God, do something. Landeskog. Down to Nate. Oh, big save by Hiller. I can't even be mad. That was a nice save. But damn, man, these chances. All right, guys. Well, that's gonna that's gonna do it for two periods. Peter Mrazek has made one save in two periods as we trail four to three. Uh, play of the period is gonna go to Seth Jones for that pretty nice move. Don't get me wrong, that's a nice goal. He's going fast as hell, but Mrazek, man, like just not looking good whatsoever. I think we need a new goalie, and we're gonna need him pretty quick because he's been a problem for a few games now. Let's go ahead and take a look at the stats. Your shots are 23 to 5 in your time and attack. Well, we're almost tripling them. We're literally leading in every category except for passing. And, of course, the actual scoreboard. So this is, uh, this ain't looking good. Oh my goodness, Anders Lee! That was a beauty. 4-4, shorthanded goal. We finally tied this game. Now we gotta keep it going. As we have absolutely dominated. Don't get me wrong, but that's a nice move, Lee. Well done, buddy. Didn't think you'd be able to pull it off. Yoshi's in! Clap! Big save by Hiller. Oh, man. We gotta shut him down here. Good play by, uh, by Lee there. Lee, stepping up. Having a good game here. That's Sundin, apparently. Five seconds. Maybe one last chance for Anders Lee. He's in. I don't have a shot other than that. And that is going to do it for your third period. We're going to overtime somehow. Tied at three. As he didn't even have a shot in the period. Not a single shot that period. We held him off the shot board. And still, we're tied. Your stats after three periods, somehow, we're not destroying him. He has four goals on five shots. He's only had one hit this entire game. I just, man, I don't know. If we don't, if we do not win this game, I'm going to go berserk. Big save, but it's not going to matter. Cam Atkinson buries it. This is absolutely ridiculous as we take the loss here in a game that there's literally no reason for us to have lost. I, I don't understand. I do not understand. Yeah, we have, we're officially advancing to Div 8, but what the hell? Happened in this game. <laughs> oh man, guys, I'm not happy. Overtime loss means a regular two gold player pack. I'm not guaranteed anything in this. I'm honestly bummed out. Like that. <laughs> Brock Nelson or Claude Giroux. Okay. Makes me feel a bit better. Makes me feel a bit better. We got Claude Giroux to add to the team. That's great. That is a huge addition. But holy hell. How could we have lost that game? Claude Giroux, one of the biggest players on the team now. That's awesome. I'm super happy to have him. But, like, that is just... I That's unbelievable that we just lost that game. And I am... <laughs> I'm literally just, like, at a loss for words here by how we lost that. I just don't understand. You know what I mean? I just... I. But whatever. We'll move on. We're going to head into another game. I'm just going to play around with the lines here, set everyone up, so that way uh, Giroux's on the first line. I don't know how I feel about Landeskog. We'll give him another chance. But, holy hell. If we do not win the next game, something might be getting thrown. Alright, guys. Let's put that game in the past as we get in the game number two here. He's got Skinner. He's got Couture. We have Claude Giroux now, though. Let's try out Claude Giroux. See how he does. Haven't used his card yet this year. Should be fun. 
Let's see if we can get a W. I want to make it a big W, too. I want revenge after that last game. Wow. Logan Couture. One, nothing. It's not the start I wanted here, boys. I'm not playing well. I don't know what's going on here, but we are down again. Oh my god, Anders Lee! <laughs> Should be 1-1. One, one. Oh my god, Glendening! <sighs> Chances galore. Can't find the back of the net. Zuccarello! He destroyed that puck. The pass from Giroux. It is a 1-1 one, one game. Let's keep it going. Morazic doing something he didn't do much of last game. <laughs> Making a save. All right, guys. That's going to do it for your first period. We're tied up at one. Another game that we're definitely outplaying the guy, but don't have a lead in. I don't know. Logan Couture gets play of the period. Uh, another 1T that could have easily been blocked if uh, defenseman was playing attention. Regardless, it is a 1-1 game heading into the second. And I am feeling confident. Like I, I like I said, like in the last game, we're, we're definitely outplaying this guy. Uh, Stats-wise, shots are more even, but time and attack still heavily in our favor. So, keep it up. Sheru's actually feeling good. Oh, he couldn't get that, but Landis was going to bury the pass from Zuccarello. I don't know if Sheru gets a point for that, but he should. That was, uh... I, I was really demoralized when he lost the puck. I'm glad we put that in the net. We're up. We have the lead. I think that's the first time we've had the lead all day. So that makes me feel a little bit better. Hell yeah. Let's go. Oh, off the post. How many times are we going to hit the post this game? I think that's four already. Zadina. Oh, he couldn't get it either. Come on. <sighs> so many chances. I'm, that's another post. Oh, my God. Wait, what the, what the hell, game? What the hell? Oh, everything's going against us in this game. In both games, I don't... 2-2. Two, two. There you go, Glenn Denning. You're not going to miss that one, right, buddy? We have the lead. Let's try and keep it. There you go, Zadina! Two goal lead. Finally, we're getting some momentum here, boys. Jesus Christ, Mrazic. It's such a weak shot, finds the back of the net, and this guy is still in this game. I don't know what to do. We, I'm literally just, I'm willing to use our backup for the next game. If we don't get a goalie in the next pack, I'm willing to use our bronze backup. Because Peter Mrazek may be the worst goalie in this game. Look at Hall, thank you, buddy. Silver card coming in, scoring goals. You love to see that. We have the two-goal lead yet again. Pajot and Glenn Denning doing a good job there on the fourth line. Oh, Zook, good chance. And guys, that is going to do it for your second period. We're up by two. Feeling pretty good. We definitely outplayed this guy, but we could have a few more goals. Peter Mrazic could make a few more saves. It'd be nice, but we're doing all right. We should get the W. No play of the period, apparently. Uh, you can see the stats here. Shots, not super high-end shots, but time and attack, more than doubling them. Just got to keep it up here. A lot of players with two points so far. Zuccarello, Giroux, Pajot, and Glendening. Let's see if we can get them a couple more. Nate, let's go! Six, three... Game. Nate on the second line gets a goal, and that should be the dagger. We should get the W. Landeskog gets another point. Thank God. Is it it? Wait, they're going to give me a goal for that? Seriously? Apparently, I was given a goal for that. That is 100% goalie interference and, and whatnot, but I'll take it. Thank you, Muzzin. Gives us number eight, and that is going to be a special pack. We lead by four. We're going to win the game. Feels good. Oh, 
Oh, Nate! Point four seconds. I believe that's point number four for him, too. I might be wrong. That could be point number four for Nate. Point four seconds. <laughs> if that... If that counts, if that if that's his fourth point, that is huge. We get the gold reroll as well. Wow. All right, guys, we are officially moving on to Div Eight. Yay! <laughs> oh, that was his fifth point. I didn't even need that goal. Okay, sorry. Well, Nate has five points in the game, so that means we're getting that gold reroll. These are your final stats. We deserve the win. Let's get something big. All right, guys, we have three packs to open up. We have a Div 9 title reward pack. You're not getting anything in this. You'll get a contract, a healing card, maybe a bronze player, you know. Hey, a silver player. I will take that. Two silver players. Hell yeah, I don't care. So, we do get to open up our gold reroll. That's the premium two gold player pack. So, we're going to go ahead and open it up. Guaranteed to have at least one 80 or better. Give me a high quality goalie. We got Ryan Ellis and Cody Gol Golubev. Okay, well, Ryan Ellis, a good addition to the team. Gonna make it. He's gonna make it. He's gonna play on the third D pair with Jake Muzzin. That'll mean Justin Hull is gone, but that's okay. I like it. Ryan Ellis, former Spitfire, added him to the team. Now, we get to open up one of these. Which one do we want to open? 85 per... Or, sorry, 4% uh, of an 85 plus... 5.6% of an 85 plus. And 83% of an 83 plus. Um, let's do the, uh, the the choice pack then. We're guaranteed an 80 overall in this one. The other ones, we're not guaranteed an 80. So, let's see what we get. We don't get a gold coach because, of course, why would we? Just need one big player. Hopefully a goalie. Another coach. Sells for 200. So cool. Come on, game. Be good to me. We got Lucas Dudera and Andrew Hammond. So we do get a goalie, but 74 overall, I don't know if we're going to use it. We'll see. We'll see. If that's the best pull we get, then, you know, we do get a guaranteed 80 plus in this pack. But if we already have them, we don't want to add them, then we get a shark jersey or a con like what? Why? I don't know about these choice packs, man. I remember back in the day, choice packs were sick. We got Nathan Bull, you and Daniel Schmoles. Okay. Last round, we're guaranteed an 80 plus. What are we going to get? Steven Stamkos, what? All right, well, Steven Stamkos, welcome to the team. What an addition. We're not going to be keeping Hammond, I'm sorry. We got to keep Stammer. I'm going to move Landeskog down, put Stammer on the first line with Giroud and Zuccarello. We can really spread out the uh, the strengths on our team now. What does Stamkos have for face-offs? 84, Giroud is 94. Well, yeah, that just makes sense. Stammer... You play on the first line, which is a Rue and Zuccarello. And then Landeskog take over for Gord. And then Gord will take over for someone else. And, you know, we'll, we'll just set everything up here. But, guys, Zuccarello. Stamkos is a massive addition. I'm very happy with that. Uh, Landeskog, yep. I'll go ahead and set everything up here. And Pajot is going to be the last one to leave here. Yanni Gord's got BL. doesn't matter. Synergies do nothing for me at the moment. But guys, that is going to do it for the episode. Thank you so much for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed two first line additions after a game that we really didn't uh, deserve to lose and then a game that we dominated and we got, our, uh, we got our packs. I'm very happy with the results. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. We'll see you in Div 8. I'll see you later.